unique. I like to do this sometimes, especially around this time of year, um, where it's almost where right now in our organization, we're doing a lot of planning for 2024 and a lot of out in the future. But it's also nice to also look back. And uh, one of the things like I personally try to do with my own family and stuff is look back and, and see the, the kind of the trail that God has taken me personally and see the faithfulness that, that he's kind of like, just like what you're saying, the things that in the moments where I sit there and I go, this is a setback. Yeah. This yeah. is not a setback, you know, because it's really just preparing me for a later challenge that I'm going to be able to overcome and help um, the kingdom of God in a moment that, you don't even all, all know about do, yeah, I don't even know about all he's doing is preparing me for a future battle. And um, it's tough to do in the moment because I think sometimes, I, you know, I always I always act like a, uh, a spoiled brat sometimes <laughs> in the moment. Um, like, God, why me? Uh, you know, Jimmy, uh, Jimmy, one of the, the guys down at uh, um, Yoder Metal or, or COO, he he actually said this and it's kind of stuck with me. But, you know, when you do say why me? You know, he kind of has the thought thought of why not me? Mm -hmm. You know, I'm built mm -hmm. for this moment. God oh, chose good. me for this mm -hmm. moment. Oh, that's um, powerful. And yes. uh, and so, uh, I'm. It sounds like there you definitely got a a. Uh, you can see the thread of God's faithfulness in your life, preparing you for what you're currently walking in. 